Thank you for watching this walkthrough of your website. It is a dashboard website application where you log in to your control panel, administrate, upload, add, edit, and delete your web contents. Images are resized, cropped, and things look great. This video will show you what it looks like out of the box and what it could look like once you've added your web contents and to give you a brief orientation of its features. The following video clips in this series will demonstrate how to operate the control panel and show some tips and tricks and recommendations. I will be as brief as possible, so let's get started. The web application has a modern look and feel. It scales in a friendly way to fit various monitor sizes. It can also be displayed on mobile devices such as cell phones and tablets. It's customizable. You can choose between different color combinations, upload background images, your logo, and display various company related information. But you can also add keywords and descriptions for search engines to find. There are different versions to choose from. A generic version for, let's say, a dentist or a lawyer, a horse edition, and a horse breeder edition, which we will take a closer look at in this video. More versions are in the works, such as a fine arts gallery edition, for example. So stay tuned. Let's browse around a sample site. The contents in this sample is from americasarabians.com, trainmyhorse.com, and other sources. Here's a home page of the Horse Breeder Edition. The standard Horse Edition looks similar. There's a navigation bar on the left, some contents that is set to be featured on the right, in this case the main stallion, a staff member, and a video clip, and some randomly generated contents below, of offspring, broodmares, and videos. Each section has a More button, which links to its respective topic. More images and text blocks can be added to the home page. The images resize themselves to match the height of the text blocks to maintain a balanced layout. Let's explore the horse records in general. Clicking on the horses link will list all horses, divided into stallions, broodmares, offspring, and for sale. Since this is the breeder's edition, it is listing broodmares and offspring, and it's not placing a premium on geldings which is a genetic dead end amongst breeders. So in this breeder's edition, a gelding is an offspring, or a horse that is simply for sale. The regular horse edition would list horses by gender rather than relationship. This layout is currently set to a two-column layout. When it's set to a single-column layout, it becomes searchable. The horse pages can display three tabs, Info, Pictures, and Videos. The Info tab display general information, such as nickname, registered name, and description. There are several ways of listing pedigrees, either as an uploaded PDF file, enter your own pedigree tree, or link to an external page. It is not recommended to do all three. In this case, it's simply for demonstration purposes. The bottom of the Info page lists relationships to other horses you have on your website, sire, dam, and offspring. The Picture tab display images that tiles beautifully. The more picture you add, the better. Click on the thumbnail images to enlarge and show the picture in its uncropped state. Additionally, captions can be posted. All videos associated with each horse will be listed under the Horses Video tab, as well as on the generic Video page, which is listing all the videos of all horses. The videos are streaming from YouTube. If no images or videos have been added, these tabs are not available. Let's take a closer look at the video page. It lists all the horse videos, and that could become a rather lengthy list, so the list can be filtered by typing a search word. There's a back button, but also a button that goes to the horse. Let's take a look at links, staff, and photos. Links is an optional section for linking to affiliated websites. It opens the external web page in a separate window. Staff is also an optional section in case you wish to present some or all members of staff. The individual staff pages are divided into an info tab and a pictures tab. If images have been uploaded that is. Nice, clean and simple. The photos page can list photo albums and each album can list lots of pictures with captions. It is a good way of summarizing an event. 
You can add generic pages too. In this case, there is a page called About. A decorative image can be uploaded, as well as a gallery of images. Pages can be set to be featured on the home page, but added gallery images are not displayed. If no pages, links, videos, staff, or photos are added, or if they are checked as hidden, they will not appear on the site. Thank you for watching this demonstration. Please view the how to videos and learn how you can use the control panel to build your own website, create pages, horse records, uploading images and pedigrees, adding videos, and much more.